Today we're opening the last Ghost Rare set. What's up guys, we're back with another video. Today we're opening Dimension of Chaos Booster Box. We've never opened this as a booster box. One of my favorite sets, but we have opened it in uh, a lot of loose packs and we did really well. Before that, we do have a giveaway. I'll be giving away these two cards from Maximum Gold Eldorado, Blue Eyes, and Dark Magician. All you guys have to do is like this video, be subscribed, let me know what you think about Dimension of Chaos and let me know your favorite set. Let's get this thing open. So we opened a few hundred of these packs before and got two ghost rares. That was like a year and a half, two years ago. So let's be really careful here. We don't want to destroy this thing. But this was the last ghost rare set in Yu-Gi-Oh. That's why we opened it so much until they finally returned ghost rares with Rage of Raw. But it also has ultimate rares. So this is the last ultimate rare set, I guess. And it also has, besides OTSs, and it has ghosts. So to have both, it is the last one. These first edition boxes are actually really hard to find because I had never heard of this set a couple years ago. I found it. I was like, this set looks really cool. It has some pretty good stuff in it. I really wanted to open it. I could not find a booster box. They were like $200 two years ago. I couldn't find anything. And then I found a ton of them for $250 a piece. We ended up pulling those four ghost rares. So let's see if we can bring it back and pull something crazy. 24 packs of docks. Dimension of Chaos. The Fluffle Wings. Oh, don't spoil it. The Fluffle Wings have returned. There are a rare and a foil in, not every time, but you can get both. Ignite Cavalier. We got the Cosmo Light Sworn. Dark Contract with the Witch. Raid Raptor Field Eagle. Yep. Oh, there's the super rare. DDD Wave Oblivion King Caesar Ragnarok. We're going to have a mouthful trying to read that one. Ignite Veteran and Pot of the Forbidden. I think Pot of the Forbidden was actually worth a little bit. So we're going to pull out the Fluffle Wings, which I don't know if it's worth anything anymore. But for a while it was. Next up. So we have 24 packs here. We haven't done a booster box of this. So this is actually pretty fun. I've been considering doing this one. We have Grand Horn of Heaven. We got the Yada. Cool. Great Illegal. Yeah, I just can't believe there's a Yada like retrain. Uh, DD Burfamet. Cool. Oh, and the Black Luster Soldier Super Soldier. It took us so many packs. This was the original goal of the opening was to pull this. Not even an ultimate rare, and we cannot pull it. It took so long. The Black Luster Soldier Super Soldier. It's like a throwback to those openings. That is so awesome. Wait, that's a good start. And yeah, it's not guaranteed supers. So is it? It's not guaranteed supers? I don't think. So we're just pulling crazy so far. We've got a super and an ultra. And ultis are very difficult to pull in here, so it's going to be tough. If we get one, we got to go crazy. They're not guaranteed per box. We got a Tempest. Radiant. Oh, that's a good Kaiju. Yeah, this card was like $10 when we were opening those. I think it did get a reprint, so it's not like that crazy anymore, but it's still worth quite a bit. All right. All right, Kaijus. Yeah, there's a, there was a ton of valuable cards that finally did get reprinted between since we opened them and now. Cosmo Lightshorn. We got the Fright for March. Ignite Cavalier. DDD Wave King Caesar. And the Dark Contract with the Swamp King. Lots of DDD stuff in here, which back then, I had no idea about DDDs. Then they came out in Duel Links. I actually have some familiarity with some of them. Yeah, so it's, I, I'm, a, I'm a new man since then. DD Necro Slime, another one that we wanted. Fluffle Wings, they're always together. Flush Fire, another decent one. I didn't realize that was banned when we were opening those. Samurai Cavalier of Reptier. And Contract Lundering. Very cool Super Soldier Soul. Next pack of Docs. Man, these, these are very, like... Uh, wimpy packs like they, they don't have a lot of uh, integrity to them so they just rip right down the middle plush fire we got the human resources desk bot jet that's cool giant pearfish and oh a secret rare odd eyes vortex dragon this comes in ultimate rare as well that is ooh, that's a nice card odd eyes vortex dragon very beautiful you love to see it very very nice okay our pulls have been crazy so far we've already got a secret rare ultra and a super wow okay Odd Eggs Vortex, I don't think is a very good one. Uh, we would rather probably have the Scarlight, I think. It comes in Secret Rare, Ultimate Rare, and Ghost Rare, as you guys know. DDD Savant Galilele. Galilele, Galilele. <laughs> Soulhorn struggling. Uh, the Oblivion King Abyss Ragnarok. This one's pretty good, I think. And then the Rebel Leonidas. Very cool. Super Rare. And Super Heavy Samurai. So there's Samurai, Super Heavy Samurais in here. I don't think they ever took off. Oh my goodness. Why won't these. Uh, Exit the packs correctly. Tempest. Gradle Impact. Super Heavy Samurai Soul Horns. Dark Contract with Ears. Perform a Pal Second Donkey. And Despot 006. Cool. Super Rush Headlong is in here. I totally forgot about that. That is the most dual links of dual links. That card was big for like two years. Okay. It's finally been eclipsed. But Gradle, we got the uh, Alligator, Transporter, Yada. Mad Inspector. Oh, Kieran, and this is like a crazy good card. Like at the time, I didn't realize how banned this card was. That's pretty cool. Shuffle Reborn, Samurai Drum, Veteran, and DD Swirl Slime. It doesn't seem that long ago that we opened these, but it really was. It was forever ago. It was so long. Okay, let's see if we can pull something crazy there. Dark Contract with the Witch, Gradle Alligator, 
Necroslav. I don't even know what these boxes are worth, but they're worth way too much, I think. Kunai the Drizzle and Samurai Thief. The Cosmo Wicked Witch. Shuffle Reborn. Next docks. Let's keep going. Fright for March. The Fright First. Ignite Cavalier. Grand Horn of Heaven. Mad Inspector Crow Yada. Great of Slime. And. Ooh, DDD Duo Don King Kaliga. Kaliuga. Not Kaliga. There we go. Super rare Kaliuga. Man, DD stuff. We are getting a lot of it. Mad Inspectors and Super Soldier Soul. This is the last pack on the right side. We actually. It's bit, we just don't have a lot of booster boxes anymore. Unless, like, new sets, I guess, is basically it. Great old Eagle. Fluff of Wings, good. Raid Raptors, Ultimate Mace. Skull Eagle. Sphere Karibo, another epic uh, Duel Link slash uh, um, just, yeah, Speed Duel card. There we go. Luster Soldier, Super Soldier. The card that we could not pull for like 200 packs or something. We open it and get it twice in the same box. Wow. I think it's only like 40, 30 bucks, something like that. But that is one of my favorite cards. The reason we originally opened this was because it's nostalgic, you know, retrain basically. Not because there are any other good cards and we get it again. Oh my goodness. That's an incredible half. And yeah, ultimate rares are like one every three boxes in this era, something like that. So that is actually insane. Not only to get one, but to get the one we actually want. We got these soul horns. Great of slime. DD contract change, cool. And Super Heavy Samurai Thief. Wow, that, that's nuts. If we get like a Ghost Rare, this is literally the best box. And I could have picked the other box, but I just picked this because it had the $80 prize tag on it. Necro Slime, we got the Fright for March. Radio After Feet and Eagle. And the Fright for Sabretooth. This is another one that had not been reprinted when I was opening this. It was a $20 card. I think it got reprinted, so it's probably more like $4 or $5 now. But wow. This is a great box. Like, if we had opened this back then, this was a bit, would have been incredible. Because I think the Super Soldier actually went way up at one point for some reason. Uh, I don't think it was because of our openings, but it could have been partially because of that. Galilea, the Witch, Alligator, Toon Barrel Dragon. This is another decent one. And Super Soldier Rebirth. Very, there were so many rares that were worth like $2, which is why I wanted to open this set. Because I would usually make a lot of my money back. I would make uh, either from Toon Barrel Dragon or from uh, Radian would make like five packs back because I bought them for $2 each. We got the Transporter, Great Old Alligator. Skilled Red is very cool. The Legendary Fisherman 3, that's another cool one. Okay, wow, there's so many supers in here. They're not in every pack, but it feels like they're almost in every other pack you get a foil. Whew. Wow, what an amazing box. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Let's go. Dark Contract with Errors, Great Old Eagle. Fluffle, Wings, Ultimate, Raptors, Ultimate, Mace Windu, Didi Burfamet. And Gradle Cobra. All right. Felt Psychic Blade. Like, I don't even know what else. Like, we've already pulled Ulti, Secret, two Ultras, a bunch of Supers. Like, there's got to be nothing left, right? I mean, unless there's a Gosher, which is possible. Fluffle Wings, Cavalier, Pendulum Area, Ignite Vetter. I mean, this is the set we have crazy luck with. So, if it's ever going to happen, it would be now. So, uh, I'm just banking on that. By the way, I think this set came out around late 2015. So it's a pretty uh, it's a pretty old set at this point. It's like almost that's seven years ago, guys. Dark contract with the gate. Perform a pal help princess and the mirror conductor Cosmo Wicked Witch and the DD Swirl Slime. We're about three quarters of the way through this opening. Okay, plush fire. Raptors ultimate Maze. plush fire is a cute card. I right, just check this out. I mean, just look at that card. It's a cute little fire ice cream cone. We got the fire out of our first aid squad. There we go. Perform a pal second donkey. DD contract change, very nice, and super heavy draw. Few more packs at the Ghost Rare. Chances to pull something legendary. The Scarlight, Red Dragon, Arch Fiend. We have DD Necro Slime, Fry for March. Plush Fire again. We've gotten a lot of those. Yada. Promo Pal Splash Mammoth. And a Gateway to Chaos. This is such a cool card. Throwback to uh, like Duel Links Casey Cup number one, I think. The one where, uh, what's his name? Uh, Duel Links Meta. Um, Whatever his, his actual name is. I can't remember. Uh, didn't he win with that? I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. Playing like uh, Gaia and stuff like that. Yeah. That was that was a throwback. That was like 2017. Skull Eagle. We got Soul Horns. D Necro Slime. Fluffle Wings. Gamma Seals in here. Man, there's so many good Kaijus. That's crazy. And a Contract Laundering. Wow. Wow. That's amazing. Two more packs. This has been a great opening, guys. Great opening. Docs. This has been worth. I mean, not really worth because I think the box is really expensive, but we've done pretty good. Great Old Eagle, Grand Horn of Heaven. Super Soldier Ritual had some value. I don't know if it still does, but here we go. Magic Spectre Kyobi. Okay. And a Raid Raptor. Cool. And the final pack of the opening. 
Dimension of Chaos. Let's do this. Hit that like button, guys. For luck, we got to pull that ghost right. We got a Yada. We got a dark contract with the gate. Savant Galilee. Rank up Magic Raid Force. And DD Swirl Swine. A slime. Okay. That was an amazing opening, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel because we will be doing more epic openings like this in the future. Even more epic. Some less epic. Some the same. Who knows? Shout out to TCG Trust, Scar, Stone Fuss, Show, Tomato Juice, Noah J, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Duelist King, Carnes, Banky McFarland, G Raider, and Daxter. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.